Hello and greetings YouTube. Thank you guys for joining us today as I get ready for an adventure. I'm also going to drink some coffee while I talk to you guys. And uh, maybe you'll do the same. Basically, what you guys see here before you is all the kit and gear that I'm going to be using tomorrow on a 34 mile day hike. And it's going to be an all day and a good part of the night hike as well. Um, it's going to start in Damascus, Virginia. Go to Abington, Virginia, and then back. I'll be starting at 5 o'clock in the morning, and I'll be getting back to Damascus. You know, it'll be after the sun goes down. I'm not entirely sure, but it's going to be a long one. Um, go be starting at 5, get back in the dark. And so this is all the kit that I'm going to be taking with me, excluding the clothing. And uh, I figured I'd show you guys what I'm going to use, what I'm going to take with me. Um, I'll put in the description the specifics on this gear, but I'll just kind of lightly touch on everything here so you guys see what I got. For the pack, we'll be using the Black Diamond Octane Bag. Freaking awesome bag. I got this on sale at, uh, I think it was REI. You can see that there. It's a really nice pack. Very comfortable. Um, and I cannot wait to use it again. I haven't used it since I was in Hawaii. Hiking around on the tallest mountain in the world. But, uh, let's see. So with that, I'm going to be using the platypus bag as my bladder here. This is uh, three liters, and I'll go ahead and fill that up. Um, I will be taking with me my Nalgene bottle. It'll be empty, because at some point in time, I'm going to have to fill this thing up. Three liters is not enough water for an adventure like this. It's not definitely not enough. So I'll be using my SteriPen to uh, filter my water. That's, uh, of course, it uses UV light here. To sterilize absolutely amazing technology that is a life save lifesaver and a game changer right there uh, let's see I will be using the uh, front pack by ribs as well such a good pack I highly recommend it I've been using this for a while now and it's just fantastic um, and you can get it for a really good price and if you guys are interested in that uh, contact me and I'll tell you how uh, not much to it uh, let's see here. We have the uh, Garmin GPS Map 62 STC right here. Uh, that'll be the GPS unit that I'm going to use to uh, basically record my trek. I will be taking my uh, my old smartphone. I, I don't actually use it anymore for data or anything like that, but it does make a great MP3 player. So I'll be listening to some coast to coast and maybe some documentaries or something as I uh, trek along on the trail. i got my Casio um, uh, smart, uh, flip phone. Uh, if you guys have seen my other videos, this is the military spec one. Waterproof, dustproof, radiation proof, all that good stuff. And I got my, let's see, it's the Timex watch. I guess it's an Iron Man or something or other. Yeah, it is. Good watch. Um, Got my headlamp, got plenty of extra batteries, got extra batteries for the GPS as well. Um, and another little uh, photon light in there, which is absolutely awesome. I will definitely be using this since I'll be starting out in the dark and getting back into Damascus in the dark. Um, got my Buck 112 knife, that'd be at my side. And we have the Optimus stove. I'll be taking that with me since I'll be eating on the trail. You know, I got my gas. I got my little pot to boil some water in. And of course, I got the I light my fire spoon fork knife combo. And I'll be using this to cook the mountain house meals. We have the scrambled eggs and bacon and the lasagna with meat sauce. And I've got a ton of other snacks and stuff here. I got instant coffee. This is going to be awesome. Especially when I get back into town or as soon as the sun goes down. I might have to make some coffee and enjoy it next to the river. Um, i got some trail mix, which I made here. It's got a muffin that's kind of dried out and smashed up in it. Ah, this is so good. All the carbs in that give me lots of energy. Got some protein bars. <clears throat> yeah, let's see here. We got the uh, 
uh, med kit. I'm going to take some of that stuff out. A lot of it I don't need. I don't need the extra weight either. So, But I'll definitely be taking the moleskin and the uh, pain reliever because I'm going to need it. There's no doubt about that. You cannot hike or walk 34 miles without a blister or needing some pain relief. So I'll definitely be taking that. Um, got my gloves. Got a uh, package of hand warmers. It's only one in this, but it is resealable. And it lasts up to 10 hours. These really work well. Got a killer deal on the climb.com. Uh, fantastic stuff. Um, that's going to be nice as well, especially in the morning, especially with it being 21 degrees out there. But it's going to be a nice day. It's going to warm up to about 50. So, whoops. I have to talk to you later. Uh, anyway, so it'll warm up to about 50. It's going to be a beautiful day. But uh, it'll be on the chilly side, especially down in the valleys and stuff. Um, where the sun don't shine. And since it will be such a nice day, I'll be taking my hat here. And it is a, uh... Sorry about that, guys. Makes a lot of racket. <laughs> Let's see, what does the tag say on here? Pacific Company. Hat. Super fantastic. That'd be nice and comfortable. And it might stop me from getting a little bit of sunburn on my face. Um, so basically, guys... Excluding excluding the uh, clothing, that's the gear I plan on taking with me. Uh, if I make any changes or alterations, I'll put it in the description. And uh, also in the description, like I said, I'll go ahead and detail the specifics on this gear. Um, and if, if you guys have any questions, you can, of course, let me know. And uh, it's, it's going to be an exciting trip. Um, I'm going to be a wounded warrior after it's over. There's no doubt about it. Uh, Definitely going to be limping some for a couple days and lose some toenails and have some huge blisters, which uh, I might have to take some photos of so you guys can see them later. <laughs> it's going to be pretty rough, but uh, it's going to be a fantastic trip. Anyway, I just thought you guys would uh, like to see the gear, the kit, and uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Thank you for uh, watching and coming by. Uh, you guys take care.